Hi guys, uh, this time one very simple thing, how to use a batch machine. So I'll design a model with uh, one part, one machine. Let's make the part active, entering each second minute uh, one by one into the machine O1. Validate, confirm, confirm. And the machine O1 is gonna push to ship. I'll confirm, I'll switch on the element flow. Themes should be working, except for the cycle time of the machine 01. Let's set it 15 minutes and uh, the patch machine. It means that we need to change the type. Here we've been using a single machine, assembly machine, there are many other options, but the only other we will be using during the semester is the batch machine. So I'll choose the batch machine. And the input field here became active. So I can specify what's the batch size. In our case, let's make the batch size to be 5. And that's going to be the minimum batch size and also it's going to be the maximum batch size. So that means that it will always wait till five parts are available for the machine. And only then the cycle time will start. The machine will start to operate. Uh, in reality, what can that mean uh, it can be it can be for example a painting machine which uh, is able to paint uh, several pieces several parts at once in some cases it can be even hundreds of parts uh, at once i'll confirm this dialog with okay i'll highlight the little guy so we see slow motion what's happening I'll start the model and we see that it always waits until five parts are available for the machine and only then it actually starts working. So you see the yellow color is idle waiting till the parts come and then it turns green meaning it's uh, working. Okay and that's that's it for this time, that's all, that was the batch machine.